पाकिस्तान <laughs> and so we will see what happens uh, we have approached certain political parties that are clean uh, like the jamaat e islami and they have a mandate <laughs> we'll talk to them but at the moment because our mandate has been stolen more than 80 seats of different mnas from all over pakistan have been reduced to give an unfavorable edge either to people's party or to noon league therefore we're looking at our options but either a weak government or a coalition with those people that the country has rejected neither are possibilities for us so uh, what do you think the people are going to, i mean what challenges they are going to face pakistan is facing an acute economic crisis in the next 2 to 3 months uh, the imf agreement mandates increases in different services and different bills uh, we owe thanks to mr sardar's uh, lovely economic mismanagement we have to pay up up to 25 billion dollars in bonds so this is going to be a very tough year for pakistan if anyone thinks that they can get away with this rigging and make a successful government and get rid of these loans and give the people a way to live they're joking everybody knows and that's the only reason that the entire western media has turned against these pakistani elections because uh, there was an article yesterday in new york times that said pakistan has run out of friends and out of begging bowls that's how disgusting we've become in the world arena we've become a joke simply because the people of pakistan want to vote for khan so um as you've said it's all about the rigging and people are just uh, stealing the mandate of pti what do you think if you are going to make a government what would be the road map to all the uh, like what kind of solution you are going to bring forward they haven't stolen the mandate of pti they've stolen the mandate of the people of pakistan they stole their food they stole their money they stole their livelihoods they took away the health card they took away the kisan card we had a dozen different welfare programs for the neediest in pakistan first they stole them all then they stole their election but this is the last straw as you know the it's it's a it's a straw that broke the camel's back the people are simply unwilling and if we haven't learned anything from our past from our history god forbid you can see mayhem on the streets and we don't want that our leader is very capable of calling for any kind of protest he has resisted so far we're doing peaceful protests we are telling our protesters not to go with any sort of mask because we know people uh, the elements that concocted up a 9th of may they want to do another sort of false flag operations so we're being incredibly cautious we have the right to protest under the constitution unless they've also done away with the constitution uh, at present whatever is happening to pakistan is a joke it's macabre it's like a bizarre comedy but we are going to stay the course we are going to demand our freedom and our justice both and that is our right thank you thank so you. much thank you कुदरत की तखलीक में कोई कमी नहीं बस देखने वाली नजर चाहिए कुदरत के बनाए इस निजाम में कौन है फसादी और कौन कर रहा है हक की मनादी एब्सोल्युटली नॉट कुदरत की सब पर नजर है मजलूम की आहो या सालिम पे पर्दा कुदरत की नजर से ओझल नहीं कुदरत का ऐसा ही एक शाहकार है जो नजर भी रखता है और पल पल की खबर भी बराह रास्त जल से हो या रखनी हो पाकिस्तान समेत दुनिया भर की खबरों पर नजर तो अभी सब्सक्राइब करें YouTube पर डेली कुदरत को या फिर फॉलो करें सोशल मीडिया पर डेली कुदरत को और रहे हर लम्हा बाखबर कुदरत हर वक्त बर वक्त